zero money, zero medication. Please help us, like we were uh, tra trapped on uh, an island somewhere. Hundreds of Canadians who have been stuck in Cuba since the plane crash last week have finally made it home. Now I feel great because I'm home. The Cubana Airlines flights landed at Montreal's Trudeau Airport on Wednesday afternoon. It was hard because we didn't have much information until like yesterday, so it took some time. But finally we're home and we're just happy to be back. Cubana Airlines grounded all its flights after one of their passenger jets crashed after takeoff in Havana last Friday, killing 111 people. The beginning when we uh, left off, Everybody, I think, was stressed, and at the end, everybody cheered, like, loud. Many of those stranded were supposed to fly home Friday. They did have food and lodging while stuck in Cuba, but felt they were left in the dark. This traveler waited three days and ran out of medication. I have only one pill for tomorrow. What's going to happen the day after? What's going to happen the, the day after? You're so nervous, you cannot sleep, and nobody help you. That's the problem. I think they could have given us more information at the beginning from when we would have had a flight instead of just leaving us in the dark. Carib sold the Montreal agency many of them booked their travels with, said all clients were now back in Canada and would be compensated for the inconvenience. They said they were evaluating whether they would continue to work with Cubana Airlines. I just want to go to bed now. <laughs> just want to go to sleep. I go back to work tomorrow, but I want to go to sleep now and get rested. And... But I enjoyed the sun, the extra sun. In Montreal, Tina Tenere Yellow, City News.